Flashing is the most important part during the racking portion of the installation as we do need to drill in your roof to be able to attach the system. This piece here ensures that there will be no leaks. The first step is to chalk a line where the rail will be installed. Next, we find the truss and drill a pilot hole for the leg bolt. Without the pilot hole, the truss could shatter when the bolt is installed. We fill the pilot hole with outdoor rated caulking, which acts as the first additional level of leak protection and the last line of defense. Now we prepare the flashing by adding a U-shaped bead of caulking above the butyl mastic. This acts as the second level of added leak protection. Now we remove the sticker protecting the butyl mastic sealant. This sealant will melt to the roof and create a seal. There is also a rubber gasket for the leg bolt to seal against. These form the third level of leak protection. Now that the flashing is prepared and the pilot hole is filled with caulking, we lift the shingle above the pilot hole and slide the flashing into place. The last step is to secure the L foot that the rail attaches to using a leg bolt. The leg bolt has a rubber gasket that compresses onto the flashing, which is the fourth added level of leak protection. When you are installing solar on your roof, it is hard to understand the importance of leak protection. While some companies believe that caulking alone is sufficient, our experience has shown that that simply is not enough. Using a high quality flashing with multiple redundancies is really the only way to protect your home for the life of your system.